to be very honest, when I was making this beat, the only person in Africa that came to my mind was the video. To be honest, I made this beat in one hour. The first thing I made on this beat was That was the first thing I made. To make everything reasonable, I had to infuse the regular everyday snare or clap, which is. I did more so to the intro. I did brass. I wanted to give it that pom pom feel with the live feel so that live band can jump to the song every time. But at this point, I was still not satisfied with the intro. I was still not satisfied, so I had to add more drums. I did my kick. I started feeling the, the vibe. I started feeling the vibe. It was coming alive. Still want to be done. Exactly, still want to be done. I wasn't satisfied yet. So I did my conga. I did my pom pom conga. The song wasn't heavy enough, so I added one more. It's called a Cloyd Kit. A Cloyd Kit, so it gives me more life. Give me more life. To be very honest, when I was making this beat, the only person in Africa that came to my mind was the video. The beat in one hour, the idea, everything I created, or even less than an hour. And I played it for Perizzi. Well, the Perizzi played it for David. He liked it and we recorded. David was just here, right here, vibing to the mic. And okay, after the intro, after the beat, this was what we came up with. The first thing we recorded was. Okay, originally, when David recorded, when we recorded the song, the gave me assurance it wasn't there at all. It wasn't on this part. We, it just came once towards the end of the song. Then I took it home, listened, then sent it to David, and he said, "No, something is missing. That we should bring this. Give me assurance. We should make it as the hook. We should bring it forward because when originally when he sang it, when it's recorded, he just pulled up part once at the end of the song. Mm. So when I sent it to him, he was like, "No, no, this one should come." forward like earlier like the hook or something so i shifted it to this part and i felt it kind of like i liked it <laughs> so i said the big biggie should come after every after this part the big biggie should come in again it wasn't there before originally what David said after this uh, assurance part, the big big issue follow. So, and I tried it and I felt it, it was mad. So I didn't roll at all on this song. I just rolled once. So after I added a clap, then I just gave them one one roll for the culture. I am looking for When I played this for David, he was like, wow, I busted his head. I was very happy, <laughs> very happy he liked it. Recording was done in 30 minutes. How long did it take from the start for you to get to the end of the beat itself? I made this beat, to be honest, I made this beat in one hour. We got this song like second week of December. You can imagine how long. <laughs> took us to cook the song to this point.
Always stay connected and get free and personalized stories delivered directly to you. Download the new Paul's Buzz app for free now.